Hi, everybody. Yep, it's me. I'm back. And I'm holding a candle because the people this video is dedicate, dedicated to are a candle in the darkness for everything that's going on currently. They are keeping us safe and doing their best to keep, to keep us alive during this crisis. The healers, the protectors, the service people who run ill people back and forth to the hospitals, I'm talking about doctors, nurses, EMTs, police, firemen. I'm talking about people who keep our food service going so that we can still go to the store and feed our families. I'm talking about the truckers who put themselves on the line to make sure that the goods we need are at the stores. Postal workers who make sure we have word from our families and can get items through the mail that we can't otherwise get. food service people who are keeping their restaurants open and going to the extra trouble of bagging it up, boxing it up, and delivering it to the curbside. We have a lot of people to be grateful for during this and to be grateful to. Thank you, every one of you. This video idea is not mine. I picked it up from Clara Barrera, and she picked it up from, I believe, the originator. In the UK, a group got started which dedicated the rainbow as a symbol of hope to say thank you to all of the people who are trying to get our world back under control. And she challenged uh, pretty much everybody who was watching her to do a rainbow. And to say thank you. The rainbow is a symbol of hope and has been for a very long time. And not just a religious one. It was considered a sign of good fortune long ago. And it's a sign of hope. We can hope that our frontline people make it through this. We've already lost way too many. We can hope that if any of us fall sick, they'll still be there and be able to help take care of us. And we hope that we don't lose any more of them. And we are grateful and we are thankful. Now I know other groups have picked up the rainbow, but again, it's a symbol of hope. Hope that people can get 
over some of their issues and treat other people as human. It's a symbol of hope. And in this case, I'm wearing it for anyone, anywhere who is working with sick people, trying to keep them alive, trying to help them get better, transporting them, supporting them in nursing homes, keeping our food going. Thank you.